welcome back in this video we are going to study the question bank notes of karnataka first puc chapter 14 respiration in plants if you want the notes of other chapters check the playlist of my channel you can get from there first one mark question and answers name the site of glycolysis answer cytoplasm of the cell how many molecules of ATP are formed for every molecule of glucose during aerobic respiration? Answer 38 ATP molecules. What is the RQ value for carbohydrates? Answer 1. What is the RQ value for organic acids? Answer more than 1. Name the compound that reacts with acetyl CoA to form citric acid during Krebs cycle. Answer oxaloacetic acid. What is Pasteur's effect? Answer, sudden change from anaerobic respiration to aerobic respiration due to the availability of oxygen in facultative anaerobes is called Pasteur effect. Define respiratory quotient. It is defined as the quotient of volume of carbon dioxide liberated to the volume of oxygen utilized. Volume of carbon dioxide liberated. Here is the formula for that. In which cell organelle Krebs cycle occurs? Answer mitochondria. Name the phase which is common for both aerobic and anaerobic respiration. Answer glycolysis. What are respiratory substrates? Name the most common respiratory substrate. Answer raw materials of cellular respiration which can yield ATT on breakdown are called respiratory substrate. Answer carbohydrates and proteins. Next two mark question answers define aerobic cellular respiration answer aerobic respiration can be defined as a stepwise complete oxidation of food molecules into simple inorganic compounds in the presence of molecular oxygen with the release of energy what is fermentation give the equation for alcoholic fermentation it can be defined as the process of incomplete breakdown of food molecules into ethyl alcohol carbon dioxide and lactic acid by the activity of microorganisms and enzymes in the absence of molecular oxygen here is the equation for that define respiratory equation give the rq value of carbohydrates rq value of carbohydrate is this is one define rq what is its value for fats respiratory quotient rq can be defined as the ratio of carbon dioxide released to oxygen consumed to break one molecule of respiratory substrate completely rq of carbohydrate is one rq of protein is 0 0.7 rq of fats is 0 0.71 rq of organic acid is more than 1 1.2 or 1.3 what is oxidative phosphorylation answer oxidative phosphorylation or electron transport linked phosphorylation or terminal oxidation is the metabolic pathway in which cells use enzymes to oxidize nutrients thereby releasing the chemical energy stored within the nutrients in order to produce adenosine triphosphate Differentiate aerobic cellular respiration from anaerobic cellular respiration. Aerobic cellular respiration occurs in the presence of molecular oxygen. Anab anaerobic cellular respiration occurs in the absence of oxygen. Centered in mitochondria and cytoplasm. Centered in cytoplasm. Glucose is completely oxidized in into carbon dioxide and water. Glucose is incompletely oxidized into C2H5OH and CO2. Generates 38 ATPs per glucose. Generates only 2 ATPs per glucose. Occurs in a great majority of organisms called anaerobes. Occurs in only a few of organisms called aerobes. Next 5 marks question answers. Give the schematic representation of glycolysis. Answer. It occurs in cytoplasm of the cell. It is an enzymatic reaction, thus temperature sensitive. It is common reaction for both aerobic and anaerobic respiration. And here is the phases of that formula of that. Next, what are the main steps in 
aerobic respiration where does it takes place aerobic respiration it is a completely oxygen dependent process and occurs in the presence of molecular oxygen it is centered in mitochondria here glucose is completely oxidized into carbon dioxide and water it generates 38 atp per glucose and hence more sufficient energy releasing process it occurs in the majority of living organisms called aerobes and here is the formula for that give the schematic representation of an overall view of kerb cycle and here is the kerb cycle steps involved in kerb cycle note to account for two molecules of acetyl coa produced from one molecule of glucose the entire reaction has to be multiplied by 2 bioenergetics number of atps produced is equal to 2 number of nadh2 produced is equal to 6 6 into 3 is equal to 18 ATPs. Number of FADH2 produced is equal to 2. 2 into 2 is equal to 4 ATPs. The total yield of ATPs is equal to 24. Efficiency of Krebs cycle along with its predatory reaction is 30 ATPs. Explain ETS. It occurs on the inner mitochondrial membrane using electron acceptor molecules. In this step, the products of glycolysis and Krebs cycle, that is NADH2 and FADH2, pass along the electron transport chain of mitochondria. The energy held by their hydrogen atoms is released and utilized in the synthesis of ATPs. This include two processes: oxidation of NADH2 and FADH2, that is removal of hydrogen, addition of phosphate to ADP to form ATP. Hence, these processes are together known as oxidative phosphorylation. relation the electron carriers flavin mononucleotide ubq9 cytochromes are found on the surface of cristae as the electrons flow along the chain the carriers get alternately oxidized and then reduced hence these reaction are called redox reactions finally hydrogen atoms are given to molecular oxygen to form h2o which is the by product continuous supply of oxygen is required to carry this out the energy released during electron flow is used in the synthesis of atps and adps with the addition of inorganic phosphate thus both oxidation and phosphorylation occur simultaneously during the oxidation of nadh2 three molecules of atps are synthesized and during oxidation of fadh2 two atps are synthesized discuss the respiratory pathway is an amphibolic pathway answer since respiration involves breakdown of organic compounds it has been considered as a catabolic process and the respiratory pathway as a catabolic uh, process but as different substances enter the pathway as respiratory substrates and certain intermediate of the respiratory pathway are also withdrawn for synthesis of other compounds for example fatty acids would be broken down into acetyl coa for entering the pathway acetyl c1a forms the respiratory pathway will be taken out if fatty acids have to be synthesized similarly the respiratory pathway intermediates are involved in the synthesis of proteins because respiratory pathway involves both anabolism and catabolism it is called as an amphibolic pathway and here is the equation for that give the schematic representation of glycolysis it occurs in cytoplasm of the cell it is an enzymatic reaction thus temperature sensitive it is a common reaction for both aerobic and anaerobic respiration and here is the process of that give the schematic representation of krebs cycle with its preparatory reaction and here is the krebs cycle with the reactions to account for two molecules of acetyl coa produced from one molecule of glucose the entire reaction has to be multiplied by 2 
bioenergetics number of atps produce is equal to 2 number of nadh2 produce is equal to 6 6 into 3 is equal to 18 APs, atps number of fadh2 produce is equal to 2 that is 2 into 2 is equal to 4 ahtps the total yield of atps is 24 efficiency of krebs cycle along with its predatory reaction is 30 atps Describe the mechanism of fermentation in the presence of yeast and lactic acid bacteria. The first step of anaerob anaerobic respiration is glycolysis in which glucose is incompletely oxidized to two pyruvic acid molecules with two ATP and two NADH2 formed as byproducts. Pyruvic acid formed is used for alcoholic fermentation or lactic acid fermentation. In alcoholic fermentation, the pyruvic acid is first decarboxylated to acetaldehyde liberating CO2. Later, acetaldehyde is reduced to ethyl alcohol by NADH2 of glycolysis. This process occurs in anaerobic like yeasts and bacteria. In lactic acid fermentation, the pyruvic acid is directly reduced to lactic acid by NADH2 of glycolysis. NOCO2 is liberated. It occur in lactobacilli and skeletal muscles. Here is the formula for that. So this is all about the question bank and notes of your first PUC biology respiration in plants. As I have told you, if you want the notes of more lessons, check the playlist of my channel. Thank you.